history of the building is, is uh, quite uh, usual, actually. So, for example, Makati here was, uh, was the airport of Manila. Close to us, not too far away from this building, there is a tower, the original tower. And uh, the street which we have in front of us, Makati Avenue, was the uh, parking. And Etsa, which is right now a highway, uh, used to be the runway. So this, this is the corner between the, the, the runway and the parking way, and it's number one Ayala Avenue, and was open in April 1969. At the time, it was actually the tallest building in Makati. Look around yourself now and uh, take a view of all what you see. All around here used to be rice field until 1976. This is absolutely amazing. Right now at the top floor of the hotel, the Club Intercontinental Lounge. Um, for guests who want pampering, this is where they come because um, we have complete services. Express check-in and check-out is done here at the lounge. They don't have to pass by the lobby. And we do offer um, buffet breakfast in the morning, afternoon tea, cocktails. Uh, we have guest relations officers and butlers to pamper you for all your um, needs whether for business or for um, entertainment. So the concept is like a small hotel within a hotel. And I'm very passionate to invite our guests to experience um, Manila as its finest. We have several options for you. We have the old Manila, which is the Intramuros, which is the wall city. Um, if you want to experience uh, riding a calesa there, and uh, the new Manila, which is here at the Ayala Center where Intercontinental Manila is located. If you want shopping, if you're a foodie, then I would recommend to visit here as well.